Hey there, hi there, it's me, Priscilla B. Welcome to your Valentine's Day special. My heart is open to love. Listen with all your heart. The universe is speaking. Okay, these are the two um, main focuses of this reading. Okay, now we have Knight of Wands. And, you know, this is just like very like, um, you know, basically it's like telling you like, you have to like really focus on what's important to you and you have to um, not be worried about what you're leaving behind because um, there's something you need to leave behind here in order to move forward and <clears throat> it's coming from like a place of moving past something and page of of wands yeah like you're moving past the page of wands and now you're gonna go and be like the knight of wands like you don't want to sit around anymore and wait for things to happen like you're ready to make things happen and um ace of cups you know that just is like really basically like saying like look like you know, there's so much pouring out, like so many emotions pouring out right now and so many feelings pouring out right now. And it's just like an overload of, of feelings and, and, and different types of energies because there's so much going on here. That's why you're like, you're not, you're, you know what this is about, but you're moving on. You're moving past it. Um, so yeah, so what are you moving away from, right? Like, let's get some better answers on this. Okay, so yeah, so you have the Black Madonna, Our Lady of the Hermits. I transform pain and suffering into a great capacity to love. Yeah, that's like exactly what you're doing here, right? Like, these, there's too much, um, like hermit energy that's that's going on over here like it's too isolating so you have to transform yourself out of that and you have to move away from that energy and you can do that by channeling this greater capacity to love and to transform pain and suffering into a greater capacity to love because that's really ultimately what you need to do um, and then you have Lalita, the red goddess, playfulness is a spiritual power, laughter leads me back to the light. Yeah, so focusing on like funny, lighthearted, fun, and, and good times, and that's going to be really your spiritual power here. It's like just having good times and reminding people to get back to their light. You have the butterflies here. The transformation is, um, butterflies are a symbol of transformation. So that's really like essentially like what you're doing here. Um, and that's where you're, go where you're going. You, you're not focusing so much on this hermit energy anymore. You're like, you want to go out, you want to be more social, like, and, um, like social butterfly, right? Like I call myself an anti-social butterfly because, I'd like to be social, but I don't like to do it like all the time, you know? So every now and then I'll be like ready to go, but not all the time. Um, and then you have here the Skemet, the Red Lady. Um, I am pure strength. I honor my anger by giving voice to it. So you obviously, you know, are frustrated about something. Obviously, you know, this is like broken hearts. Um, valentine's day special reading here so um you know like that's because you know you have a broken heart right so you're not gonna really be like feeling happy right but that's what you're working on you're working out of coming out of hermit mode you're working on transformation and laughter is so um good here it's very healing um funny shows funny movies comedies um things that make you laugh um, that bring light to your life and, and make you feel happy. So that's going to play into um, helping you steer away from anger and focus on funny, right? Because you can channel something that happened and made you feel angry or disappointed. And you can laugh about it um, instead. Or you can just, like, you got to give voice to your anger, though. And you have to, like 
transform yourself out of this like sad like hermit mode suffering mode like pain mode into like a greater capacity to love and the only way you're going to do that really is by getting back into laughing and light <laughs> and giving your voice anger like if you're angry about something speak up about it but like also don't focus on it to the point where you're not like um, moving out of hermit mode you know you have to move out of that and you have to and you, you can use uh the black madonna a lady of the hermits she's gonna help you with that you know she's carrying the baby here she's like you know you like for instance like you're at home you know you ran out of groceries you don't feel like going out because you're too tired well the black madonna is here to say like look you have to come out you have to go shopping you have to do this and you have to because like think of it doing it for the kids sake you know what I'm saying? So that's something you have to think about. And then, you know, you have to get back into funny, lighthearted things that socialize you, butterfly, social butterfly, and make you feel good again. And you have, if you're angry about something, then just give yourself time to talk about it and say it out loud because it feels better like when you say it out loud. All right, that's what I have for you. And also, happy Valentine's Day or... Well, you know, but anyways, manifest your wishes, love and light always.